Hey guys, how are you doing? In this episode, we are going to see about iOS 18 Passwords app. This feature was built right inside the settings passwords and Apple have now made it as a dedicated app for iOS 18, iPhone and iPads. So once the official release of iOS 18 and iPad OS 18 comes out by the end of September, you will be able to use this app. When you launch the passwords app for first time, the welcome screen tells you that this passwords app has three simple options. One is autofill where, you know, while using Safari or any in-app browser that uses Safari, you can easily log in with the autofill feature and it uses strong encryption. And then the seamless syncing means that you can store the passwords within the passwords app and it can be synced between your iPhone, iPad and Mac computer. If you are using any third party password managers like LastPass or OnePassword, then right now there is no way to import the data but I'm expecting that feature you know very soon over the upcoming updates and people who are coming new to iPhone or iPad who have not used the passwords any password managers before then this will definitely be useful so they can keep all their passwords their Wi-Fi passwords and any other login credentials safely within their iPhone passwords app so click on continue to turn on the notifications and give permission as allowed and inside you can see a minimal designed a simple UI where you can store the pass keys information that Apple have launched last year and many websites and applications also started to adopt it like without any password requirement you can authenticate with your face ID and log in to your pass keys approved or authorized websites and you can store any codes like two-factor authentication codes wi-fi passwords and login credentials for any apps and websites so inside the wi-fi password you can see that when you tap and hold on the password section you can copy the password and share it with your friends you can of course show network select the show network qr code option and you know simply let your friends share connect to your wi-fi simply by scanning the qr code and it also has a recently deleted option like if you accidentally deleted any passwords or any website accounts or passkey information you can recover it from here for 30 days similar to the photos app or files app in iphone and ipad we have that recently deleted which will be definitely useful and you can create groups to share your passwords and pass keys so that your friends and family members like if you are sharing the netflix hotstar or you know any other movies or any website subscription services with your friends you know that requires the login credentials then you can create a group a shared group and share it with them so this Passwords app in iOS 18 and iPad OS 18 right now have a simple interface and features that are mostly essential and I'm expecting some more feature additions to compete with any third party password managers app and do let me know in the comments whether if you're using any third party passwords manager whether you will consider the passwords app once iOS 18 officially comes out or not as you can see you can of course generate a strong password and manually add any website account right inside the passwords app for more useful iPhone, iPad and Mac related tips don't forget to subscribe have a wonderful day